Hey, welcome to the Acer channel where we review the products that are on sale from us. Let's just jump right in. I'm so excited to today get my hands on one of these. I haven't opened the box yet. So, yes, your guess is as good as mine what we will find inside. It is the Hytera MNC580. Now, the MNC580 is a POC PTT mobile device. Um, yes, comes in a nice Hytera box, recycled box, I'm sure. And um, yes, this is the first mobile POC that they've done. Let's have a look and see what it looks like. I am excited. Okay, inside the box, we have the little booklet. Nicely packaged. Nicely, nicely packaged. Before we have a look at the radio, let's have a look at the accessories. This is a little antenna emblem on it, which I think is the antenna. Um, there's a microphone, I think. Let's put it one side. And that seems like a cable. I would suppose it's maybe the power cable. Okay, well, let's start from, from this item, which I believe is the power cable. Just put in loosely like that. They could have saved a lot of space with packaging, but nevertheless okay you cannot fit that wrong three wires on it I suppose it is plus minus um, I don't know what the other one is I will post um, a link below or some information below as to what exactly the third wire will do so I think the one in question will be the blue one which could maybe be ignition control to switch your device on when you get in the vehicle um, or maybe external GPS I'm not sure okay let's have a look at the next thing which we have is the supplied antenna all nicely packaged stuff um, I like that um, I really do like this um, oh it is the GPS antenna and another antenna okay so the other antenna will be let's put that away it's an sma normal sma connector okay i don't know what the gain on this antenna is is it 3g 4g anything we don't know much about that at this point but it is a removable antenna some of the other devices i've seen have a built-in gsm antenna which is not good um, and then it also has a SMA for the GPS, magnetic GPS antenna. It's basically a standard type antenna um, with probably about 5 meters of cable on it. Magnetic. Okay. It seems to be fairly standard. Let's have a look at the microphone. Um, oh, I don't know why they've done that. Okay. Okay. Microphone hook. Seems to be a decent microphone hook. Okay. And then RJ type connector on. Non replaceable. Oh, I'm actually wrong. I like this. This is a replaceable microphone with a type C connector on it. Oh, this is very nice. I certainly like this. Yes, so you can replace the curly cord part, which is certainly going to be expensive. I can tell you now from my experience with Itera. Um, but nevertheless, we have a nice DTMF style microphone um, with a menu up and a down um, one two three four um, number keys um, a star a lock at the back we have a decent mic hook I'm not too sure how strong this is though um, I'm not crazy about the mic hook being on 
on a clip like that. But I suppose it is not too stupid because you can you can hook that on maybe like a someplace on your truck or your uh, dashboard or something instead of drilling a hole in for for the mic hook. So I suppose they've put some thought in there and come up with this. Okay, obviously some emergency button, PDT button which is plastic and a bottom button which is rubber. Okay, um, it seems like the microphone is openable so you can repair it. It has a nice feel to it. It does feel slightly bulky with that part there so people with smaller hands may have a problem. It may fall out of your hands easy um, as that part pushes against against your your hand there so you you need to you need to really hold it like that i believe and key holding it like that is a bit difficult to that part there just a side note nothing negative just a side note something i've observed okay now the exciting part let's have a look and see what the device itself looks like okay we have the installation accessories a nice sturdy um, mounting bracket I must say it's a bit thinner thinner than some of the others but nevertheless enough mounting holes um, actually very nice um, enough options there with these wing nutted um, nuts okay now let's see this is actually very nice I do like it um, I like the rubber there so if you put the the mic in you'll see that it, it, it it's nice and secure okay it is wide um, voltage range as well so you can use this on 24 volt 28 volt up to 36 I like that nice branding on the top I like it when companies do that um, yes I would have put Hytera maybe there if it was my product um, one negative thing I see I don't know what that is is it ambient light or is it a microphone for ambient noise maybe um, the on and off would probably be there uh, emergency button and some programmable buttons all rubber so that is plastic but all the other knobs are rubber um, and just because we are having a look at it let's have a look and see it fits nicely um, I think that's a good weatherproof waterproof seal there okay these parts are plastic I understand the fact that the bracket are maybe a bit more um, lightweight than what we would expect from other products um, so once it's mounted it's it's fairly neat there's no problem with that okay on the back one negative thing as mentioned before I didn't complete my sentence there um, is that that is on the back the speaker is on the back it does not seem very big um, it does not seem very big um, and then also um, the one GPS antenna and GSM antenna that are in different locations which is good you can always refer to it as a top one or the bottom one and um, they are extendable okay and then you have your DC connector there okay and then obviously you have some accessory connectors there for external speaker and you have a old mini USB connector there I like this product it seems fairly nice um, at the bottom you've got your space for a SIM card and they indicate some one only one SIM card could be a problem especially if you have overseas if you're roaming overseas you need to replace the SIM card 
but a memory card as well why exactly you would want a memory card i don't understand maybe for upgrading saving of some of the feet the functions um yes this is a very nice device i do like it um i would just suggest that you would buy or purchase another antenna external antenna which does not come packaged with this one um I don't know how well this device will perform with just that antenna on the bottom like that mounted in a vehicle nevertheless I do like it I will do another review with this device being programmed on our platform so you can just see what the display looks like nice and crisp um, display or is it sufficient or whatever the case is I will do another video, which I will put the link in here, uh, and a suggestion as to how this device, what it looks like um, when it's actually powered up. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe and like the videos here, and you are welcome to do some suggestions um, of any other videos you would like me to do. Um, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe and share the videos. Stay safe.